Britain's top rock stars got together to cut an album called Band Aid, which became the fastest selling record ever. Ah, what a great song. It's Christmas time. Bob Geldof was this amazing guy. He was one of the original founders of a band called the Boomtown Rats. He also put this band together called Band Aid uh, for African relief efforts. If one record raises $10 million for Ethiopia, it's only a Band Aid. You know, it's like a deep hemorrhage with, which needs 20 stitches and you put a Band Aid on it. It was a nice thing that we did. They did. The Brits did. We didn't do anything. We did We Are the World. We had Dan Aykroyd singing. We cared about Africa way before you did. Yeah, you were busy shoving your faces, but what? It was such a powerful video. You can see all these like legendary musicians, like Bananarama and Duran Duran. <laughs> if you look at the women in particular, and not to be catty, not a good looking one among the bunch. Honestly, Boy George was the best looking woman on that album. Everyone remembers Bono's line. That's a sweet Christmassy sentiment if I've ever heard one. I literally would cry every time that line came on. I remember my drunk uncles used to say that. Thank God you're getting that sweater, not me. Underneath it all, Do They Know It's Christmas was really about converting Africans to Christianity no matter what it took. If they don't know it's Christmas now, they damn well better pretty soon. They ain't getting any of our food. I remember being like, wow, they, maybe they don't know it's Christmas because they're just too busy. They ain't hungry.